You driving? Some plan Bs are smarter than others. If you're drinking, don't drive. RBT means you need a plan B. Authorised by New South Wales Government, Sydney. Well, as uh, I think Glenn said, this scholarship program started in 2006. Uh, seven full programs have finished before here. This is the eighth intake. And uh, it's interesting to know some of the stats that are, are behind those seven years that we've been going. In total, there have been 64 scholars inducted in the program, 49 boys and 15 girls. Of those 64, 26 have played first class cricket already and there will be more coming through as you can imagine the last few years are only young and they're coming through the program but already in the seven years there's 40 percent of the of the um, of the scholars have in fact played first class cricket which is a terrific hit rate and of those uh, 24 uh, eight have gone on to play test cricket for australia five boys and three girls, and names, of course, have been mentioned. It's, um, I think it's a fantastic thing. I, when I first started, if I got that hit rate, I'd have been extremely happy. I would never thought it was possible to, to do it, but so far it has happened, and it's going to get any better. Basil, Hel Basil Sellers, excuse me, is an outstanding friend of everyone at Cricket New South Wales, and I would argue everyone in cricket in Australia. He's made a massive contribution the development of young players in the state and Australia, as you've heard, over many, many years. Listening to Basil tonight, the thing that I find most amazing is how selfless he is. He's actually up here thanking everyone in the room, when in fact it's everyone in the room that should be thanking and honouring Basil. I think we owe an extremely huge amount of gratitude and thanks to everything that Basil has uh, achieved and delivered through this amazing scholarship. The scholarship helps young cricketers and I would also like to thank all of the parents that are not only here tonight but those that can't be here because you play an extraordinary role in your children's development, not just as cricketers but of course as people. This amazing opportunity I urge you as a group to make sure that you make the most of it and, and put in to make yourself not just a better cricketer but actually make you a better person. I know that that's the hope of Cricket New South Wales and also of Basil's. So Stephanie DeFaro, this is your first Basil Seller Scholarship? Yeah, it is. And what does this mean to your career? Uh, it's just like a great hand to get to training, like travel money and stuff like that. And um, to pay for coaching, because I live in the Illawarra, it's harder to get to training to Sydney all the time with school as well. So it would just be really helpful to get some coaching down there from the great coaches we have in the Illawarra, so things like that. Daniel, can you tell us a little bit about what the Basil Sellers Scholarship has done for you personally? Yeah, uh, a couple of months ago I had the opportunity, thanks to Basil, to uh, go over to Sri Lanka for 16 days to do a bit of training and uh, play, play a game for a local under-23 Sri Lankan team. In the year it's changed so much to me, like with uh, the scholarship and all these opportunities I've been given, I uh, would never have thought of going over to Sri Lanka to play cricket. 